Good morning, Saints! Today is Tuesday, April 23rd, 2024. Happy birthday today to Grady Huber, Francis Odes, Louis Ornelas, and Josie Tyner. The saint of the day today is St. George. St. George was born to Christians from a noble family. When George was old enough, he was welcomed into Diocletian's army. By his late 20s, George became tribunus and served as an imperial guard for the emperor at Nicomedia. On February 24, 303 AD, Diocletian, who hated Christians, announced that every Christian in the army that they passed would be arrested. St. George refused to give up his beliefs and stayed loyal to God. St. George was then martyred for his faith. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, Crispitos, Rice, and Beans. Mm -mm -mm. Attention seniors! Sign-up sheets for the liturgical ministries at Senior Mass and Baccalaureate Mass will be posted in Senior Hall on Thursday morning at 7.45 a.m. The sign-up sheets will be across from Mrs. Andy's room. Please only sign up to help at one Mass. First come, first serve. Thanks. Any questions? See Mrs. Salazar in room 223. The boys' volleyball team is still undefeated on the season 10-0 after a win over Shawnee Mission Northwest and Daniel Academy last night. Today is the last day to buy a raffle ticket at lunch for a chance to win gift cards to QT, Starbucks, Chipotle, and a chance to win a $50 cash prize for predicting the winner of the hot dog race. The hot dog race is happening twice. There will be an exhibition hot dog challenge between the fourth and fifth innings of the baseball game. Then the money race will happen at the softball game. Come watch both and put your money on the winner by purchasing a raffle ticket at lunch. Hot dog racers are Cooper Hall, Andrew Vogt, and 7th grader Lauren Sapp. Happy Pink Out Day, Saints. The Rosemary Maher Walk for Life is finally happening this Sunday, April 28th, starting at 1 p.m. in the gym. It will be a great time walking with friends and helping women and babies. Sign up is still open online or through Mrs. Loafman, Mrs. Jones, or Mr. Best. Four corporal service hours are available, and remember, you only have a week left to complete your service hours. Those who have signed up, t-shirt pickup is today at lunch on the common stage. And walkers, you can wear your 2024 Walk for Life t-shirt tomorrow with uniform bottoms, or for $5, you can wear an old Walk for Life shirt or STA spirit wear and help support the local pregnancy centers also. Remember, Rosemary Maher Saints Walk for Life this Sunday. Here's Carter Oliver with a very special announcement. Okay, let's talk Spring Olympics. This is the last class competition event of the year, and it's awesome. Last week we had prelims. Here are the standings. As you can see, Seniors are in first with 19 points, juniors second with 18 points, sophomores in third with 17 points, and freshmen have 13 points. And that brings us to Thursday, 10 events, volleyball final, juniors versus seniors, limbo, dodgeball final, seniors against the freshmen, chariot races, pickleball final, ginger knockout, only for the redheaded among us, relay race, also called the gauntlet, table surfing, a new favorite, Musical chairs, and then we finish with Orange Chin. There's so much on the line. Can the seniors win? Can the juniors pull the upset? It's going to be fun and is part of our great tradition. You know what they say, together we shine. I'm Carter Oliver. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you Thursday afternoon. Thanks, Carter. Every summer, St. Thomas Aquinas High School offers summer classes. DCA, speech, and PE are the three classes that once again will be offered this summer. Taking a summer class allows students more room for desired electives during the regular school year. Go, so go to our STA website and enroll. Classes begin on, begin on Tuesday, May 28th and run for three weeks until June 13th. Sign up today. Mr. Lee will be hosting a student poetry reading session in the Learning Commons or on May 3rd. It will be available for general use by students during STA period. Here's a video. Oh, hello. Good morning, students. Well, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Mr. Lee with the English Department. We are hosting an open poetry reading and you are invited to participate. It will be held on May 3rd in the Learning Commons during STA period. We're looking for 20 students to read published works by their favorite poets or their own original pieces. Of course, if you would like to just listen, you are invited as well. There will be coffee, juice, and pastries during the gathering. If you do come and are not reading, please stay for the duration and enjoy the words that inspire your classmates. Your English teacher will share information about this event during class today. Sign-ups will be open at the end of the day, and it is on a first-come, first-served basis. So don't hesitate to get yourself on the roster. Thank you for your time, and have a blessed day. As a reminder, the STA Learning Commons will be unavailable on May 3rd. 
Now time for the fun fact of the day. Did you know that there are more possible combinations of the game of chess than there are atoms in the observable universe? Wow. I know. Now for our countdowns. We only have 16 school days left until summer and 19 including finals. And Saints, you only have 8 more days to turn in your service hours if you have not completed them yet. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We'll be back more for you tomorrow. I'm Matthew. And I'm Ian. Signing, signing off. off. Remember, Remember, stay classy, Saints, and together, together we shine. shine.